So we're climbing between all these rocks here on the trail. Meanwhile, there's a nice, pristine, flat, smooth trail just directly adjacent to it. It's like the AT is like, here you go, do these. Oh, I'm already soaked. Not even a mile into the day. So today is day 114. <sighs> Yesterday, our plan was to go to garden, the garden center where you can tent in the back. Um, but Ryan and I just both really wanted shower like well, but by the time we got there the garden center was already closed so the draw to go there wasn't even that good yeah there was nothing for us there other than tenting and um, a spigot there weren't like out there wasn't a the, the bathrooms closed when the store closes so it's not like I mean it still would have been very reasonable option but we were so sweaty the humidity was 100 yesterday so, so the max and even though it was supposedly like 82 with the humidity being that it's like what it's, is it 96 on the heat index i mean it was just like we were so so hot and so sweaty and we ordered pizza from this place and then we also ordered two gatorades and four waters from them <laughs> yeah and i drank every single one before i went to bed and we're still dehydrated. Yeah, it's like never peaked. ending. It's never ending. So. Today is gonna be super humid again. We just did the stairway to hell. I mean, um, stairway to heaven. Uh, ah, there's a freaking mosquito. Sorry. And I'm completely soaked, <laughs> but it's fine. Yeah. Whew. Last day in New Jersey. We're getting to the Warwick Drive-In tonight so we could watch a, watch a movie if we could stay up that late. <laughs> um, so we did stay at the Appalachian Motel. Um, and we got there pretty late. Cause we ended up, we did like um, basically 19 miles. We got there at like 7.15 or something like that. I mean, by the time we were eating pizza, it was like 9 p.m. So it was a, mm -hmm. it was a long day. Um, which is probably why we didn't film. And recently we have just been exhausted like today i'm feeling good because i got really good sleep we slept till like eight and um obviously we got a shower and laundry oh, so nice. laundry. the laundry was a bonus that we weren't expecting because it said on gut hooks no laundry yeah but i guess they um got it back up and running she, she literally did our laundry folded it and brought it back to our room she didn't fold oh, it. She didn't I fold folded it. it. Nikki folded it. Same thing. But either way, it's it smelled like probably second best laundry we've had on trail. And the best, the first best was at Ryan's mom's house. So because <laughs> <laughs> she has a brand new washer. But yeah, today is probably gonna be pretty tough. Um, but still, you know, I think our morale is just boosted from um, having a nice um, stay at the motel and, and getting good sleep and stuff. Supposedly, we've heard from a bunch of trail friends who are north of us that New York really sucks. Like, it's just hard. So. We've heard that, yeah, New York has been beating up all our friends. Yeah, so. it's a bully. <sighs> so, we'll find out. We'll be there in like eight miles. Yeah. We heard it's just like rocky and very steep, you know, ups and downs for a while. But it doesn't matter because we'll be in Connecticut soon. So, yep. All right. Well, that's the update for now. Alrighty. Also, um, I tried to upload a video from the hotel last night, like two or three times, and it failed every time because of poor cell service and poor Wi Fi. And then we got here to the stairway of stairway to heaven 
and I was able to upload on trail <laughs> because I had three bars. So that is just how it is. Like, I feel like we'll get even to town and I still won't be able to upload because the service is so bad. So. <laughs> so we stumbled upon some trail magic and a cooler here, which is so awesome. It is incredible. Ooh, Milky Ways. I'm gonna show the generous. Inside this log book. So there's a big thunderstorm that's about to roll through the New York, New Jersey state line. And I don't know if you could tell in the video, but it is so dark in the woods right now. It feels like it's 7 p.m. <laughs> We've been hearing it's 2 p.m. It's 2 p.m. But it feels like no, it feels like it's like just about nine o'clock. Like it's about to like the sun's gone down and it's about to get pitch black. <laughs> so we are just about two miles from the New York border which is awesome. And we're excited. <laughs> yep. I'm hoping that uh, this, I'm, there's two storms that are like converging. Yeah. I'm hoping it's just not gonna last too, too long. Yeah. Cause we have a exposed rocky section like two and a half miles away. So we want this storm to blow over by then. We we'll think. See. We think. Or, uh, or we might just have to kind of wait a little bit. Yeah. Because it's actually the highest point on the trail in New York. Yeah. So, not the spot to be during a thunderstorm. No. So, ooh, getting bit. All right. Best part about this impending doom of a thunderstorm is that it's like sucked all the hot air out and it's actually pretty cool right now. So, we're enjoying this like. 10 minutes of coolness. The calm before the storm. <laughs> the calm before the storm, yep. Up that nice rocky face right there. Have to put the white blaze right above the crack. <laughs> so that was fun to come up that. We got to the top of this hill right where the New York New Jersey border is, and it stopped raining just in time because this is the most exposed section we've had yet. So Guys, they're still pretty dark, and we do hear some thunder off in the distance, but I think it's moving past us, which is good. Here we are, guys. Officially in New York. In New York! Woo! Woo! So the rain stopped for a brief, like, 10 minutes while we were passing the New York, New Jersey border. So that was nice of it. But right when we uh, kept past it, pushed past it, it just started pouring again. But it looks like it's gonna stop soon, hopefully.
So we've been walking on these rocks for a few miles now Maybe more. in the rain and they are slippery Yeah. and time consuming. We gave up on the umbrellas. Yeah, the umbrellas just get stuck on all the low hanging trees, so soaked. pretty soaked right now. So just walked over that. What? Doesn't look active, but it's a little freaky. Um, so we just saw our 14th black bear on trail. Um, I didn't see it, but Nick well, I saw it and we were walking on the rock slabs and it was off to the side in the woods, kind of running and we yelled at it and it stopped and paused and then we just kept yelling and we took our trekking poles out. So then we didn't see it again. So I think it ran away. But first bear in New York, 14th bear on trail. Too many. They're everywhere. <laughs> We got to the trailhead and Nikki's mom surprised us with some chocolate croissants and a, and a vehicle. Stephanie, say hi. <laughs> so we got into New York today and we did about eight miles, I think, to the New York, New Jersey border. And then there's another I think seven to this road crossing. Um, and it was awesome because Nikki's mom and sister-in-law met us there with, and it was almost a total surprise because they did tell us like two hours before we got there that they were there. So we didn't like call a shuttle or anything. Um, so that was awesome. Um, but now they shuttled us to check it out. The Warwick drive-in. There's our tent set up. It's crazy, the, the movies don't start till 8.55, so it is 8.40 right now, which is like bedtime for us. <laughs> I got like bags under my eyes already. <laughs> uh, there's one other camper here, Siddhartha, who, who's camping next to us. Um, but we are gonna go down Nikki's um, mom, park the car down near the uh, down near that one right down there she brought some chairs we're gonna sit down there and eat a bunch of chips and watch a movie maybe maybe we'll stay up for the whole thing but man this this place is zero worthy they're like so the people at the concession stand or when we first got here they're super friendly like they're like oh if you need to charge things go over there if you need the bathroom it's over there if you need a radio go over there tell me your hikers you don't have to pay they're like oh hiker like it's awesome and they were like oh okay. how long are you staying yeah, that's like, what how I was many going nights to. yeah they're like oh like how long are you all staying for like we could we're stay like, for well, multiple days tonight, but let me reconsider yeah and there was an awesome um grill and pub down the road it was a beer garden at this farm which we just went to for dinner and got really huge quesadillas which was awesome so <sighs> over on this movie theater over here they are doing a scary movie but we're just like not up for that right now so we're watching minions we're watching minions because animated movie yeah. and i'm happy with it and then they have two other movies that start at 10 55 which you know we're gonna be sleeping by then so <laughs> there was uh i think another group of four hikers that were gonna come here tonight but uh, I think the choice of movies scared them away. Mm -hmm. So they went to a hotel. So we are gonna go sit with Nikki's mom and sister-in-law and we're gonna have a good night. All right. Such a nice sunset tonight. Yeah, I've got enough. New shoes. Fresh pears. Mm -hmm. I haven't gotten to see your latest blog. Mm -hmm. 
Does anybody? I kind of lost the story a little bit.